Hey everyone, thanks for joining us for the Crosswalk Devotional Podcast. Over the years, our editorial team at Crosswalk.com has written these devotionals, observing truths we see at the intersection of faith and life. We're thrilled to offer them to you now in podcast form. To get all of these episodes straight to your phone each week, just subscribe on iTunes or wherever you get podcasts. To find more devotional content like this, just visit us at Crosswalk.com. Words of Jesus Warn Us to Stay Alert in This World by Debbie McDaniel Read by Kelly Jane Micklin I have read through Mark chapter 13 over and over again in this past year, and it's starting to seem more real now. In it, Jesus reminds us that when we don't see certain events that indicate we are in or entering into the end times, we don't have to be alarmed. In it, Jesus reminds us that when we see certain signs that indicate we are in or entering into the end times, we don't have to be alarmed. Because he's told us ahead of time what to expect. We know from his word, such things must happen, but the end is still to come. He reminds us that we will know these are prophetic words coming to pass when we hear of wars and rumors of wars, when we see certain events unfolding, nation will rise against nation and kingdom against kingdom. There will be earthquakes in various places in famines. These are the beginning of birth pains. And also, in this one chapter where Jesus is telling us of all that's to come, signs of the end times, he says this over and over, seven different times throughout these verses. He warns us to stay aware. His words are always true. May we be faithful, wise to listen, and may he help us to apply them to life. Mark 13, starting in verse 5, says, Watch out that no one deceives you. Verse 9, You must be on your guard. Verse 23, So be on your guard. I have told you everything ahead of time. Verse 33, Be on your guard. Verse 33, Be alert. Verse 35, Therefore, keep watch. And verse 36, If he comes suddenly, do not let him find you sleeping. What I say to you, I say to everyone watch. As believers, we have hope in Christ. We know beyond a doubt He is at work in this world and He will come again. Let's keep working while it is still day. Praying for His mercy through the storms and floods, through the earthquakes, through the fires, may God draw many to Himself in these days, and may we be found living as light in a world that needs His great peace. Intersecting Faith and Life Many around us may be feeling worried and fearful in these days. Choose to trust and believe that God is working in our world, even behind the scenes where we can't fully see. Ask Him for His presence of peace to fill your life today. Ask for His help in staying aware and alert. Pray that God will help us all, as believers, to be a light to others who need His hope in dark times. Further reading, Mark 13, Matthew 24, and John 14, 2-7.